right, today we're going to do the PAS procedure to demonstrate glycogen. Step one, deparaffinize and hydrate in alcohol. Step 2.5% periodic acid for 5 minutes. Step three, we're going to remove the, the slide from the periodic acid and we're going to do three washes with DI water. One, two, and three. shift reagent. We're going to be removing the slide and putting it in the reagent for 15 minutes, which the reagent has to be allowed to be a warm to room temperature at this point. All right, we're going to let that wait for 15 minutes. You're going to put, you're going to have two changes of 0.55% potassium metabisulfate. With this, this is going to be removing the excess stain from the ship. All right, and after, after one minute, we're going to put it into the second change of metabisulfate. Six, we're going to remove the slide from the potassium metabisulfate, and we're going to put it into a new Copeland jar and allow that Copeland jar to run with running water for 10 minutes. And now you don't necessarily want the water to go directly over the slide because you could, cause you could lose your tissue this way. So we'll put it on a little bit slower and just have it running off the side like that. And now after 10 minutes of that, we'll go on to our next step. Take the a slide out of the running water. And now we're going to counter stain a half a minute in the Harrison hematoxylin. This is going to be a really quick procedure, half a minute, so. After a half a minute, we're going to go into step eight. We'll remove the slide and go back into some water. And we're going to wash well to blue the hematoxylin. Line after the hematoxylin has blue, we're going to remove it. And now we're going to dehydrate 95% alcohol, 100% alcohol, and then xylene, and then cover slip. After you cover slip, your slide under a microscope should look like this. The PAS is going to be the bright red. The carbohydrates are going to be the bright red.